Hey planner friends, it's Mia. Welcome to Life with Mia. I am going to unbox this box of goodies. This is the Felicia Jarrell Glow Up Box. If you don't know um, who Felicia Jarrell is, she is the founder owner of Goldmine and Coco. She has a separate website. There are some business related things um, on her site. She does coaching. Um, she has an email series uh, for business owners, and um, there's can the candles, um, bath oil, and a few other things that, that are on there as well. So I believe the Glow Up box, I could be wrong, but I think it is a quarterly thing or seasonal. So um, this is my first one. This is the Summer Glow Up box, and... Um, Let's get into it because I have no idea what's in here. Um, can we just say a little something for the blue tissue, the little Tiffany blue color there? Okay, so we have Busy Calming Unscented Deodorant Wipes in Cypress and Pine Naturally Absorb and Restrict Odor Causing Bacteria so you can de stress. Um, these are unscented, I guess they're made of cypress and pine. I'm not going to open them because it's one of those things where once you open it, um, it starts to, oh, they're individuals. Okay, so we got individuals, so there's 15 in here. If you are someone who goes to like the gym, this is probably nice to throw in a bag. I'm actually, I think we'll put these like in my work bag because... It's a whole lot of unhealthy stuff at the workplace. Um, do you know that they, like, are talking about legionella in the water? Like, what? Do better. Do better workplace. We've got asbestos and lead and all the things that are unhealthy and toxic to people. And every time I go there, I feel sick. I don't know if it's psychological or if it's an issue. But I'm just saying. Anyways, let's get back on track. So, <laughs> we have these. we have these wipes. Um, I've never heard of these before. I'm very, very curious, but I don't want to open up one and waste it. It feels pretty thick, like it's a, a pretty good size once you open it. Um, they're 100% biodegradable. And, um, it says cypress minimizes the growth of odor and unwanted bacteria. Eucalyptus helps to promote oxygenation of the skin and pine as a natural odor absorber to help promote a healthy microbiome. Um... No rinse required. There's not really any instructions. I don't know. I don't, I don't know. What... If anybody has any info on these, let me know. So this box, I believe, is like things that she uses. And like, it kind of reminds me of the Estee box. It's like Ashley's favorite things. Um, I think this is curated to sort of be that same way. So we have these Busy Co. De-Stress This Mess Calming Unscented Deodorant Wipes. I mean, I guess you really don't need instructions as a wipe. And it, it does have instructions. Clean, open, wipe, throw in trash. <laughs> That's with instructions. <laughs> okay. Um, we have a Moira... Looks like there's three shades, shade one, two, and three all in one. This is a Tender Rose, and it is the Signature Ombre Blush. Let's see. so long that I've 
don't know that I remember what to even do. Um, so that is the Moira Tender Rose Signature Ombre Blush. Kissy Face Tinted Lip Balm, set of three. So we have Pomegranate, Sweet Peach, and Pink Hibiscus. Um, and they each have like, Pomegranate has Pomegranate Extract, Peach has Peach Extract, and so on. They have Natural Oils, Shea Butter, Bees, they're 100% Beeswax, Vitamin E. So, let's see. Let's give it a whirl. Okay, I can tell you right away. Mm -mm. I don't like it. <laughs> it is a tastes like hairspray. You know when you spray hairspray and you use something in your mouth? It's like a hair product going on right now. Okay, let me get one of these wipes. <laughs> it's bad, y'all. It's bad. I hope this doesn't go from bad to worse. So these are pretty uh, wet. I don't have any Kleenex in here or anything. That's why you don't try things. You don't, I couldn't be a person on like TV. Anyway. I got this thing going on. See that rash on my arm? I don't know what that is from. Maybe this will soothe it. Um, these are going to be a no for me. I don't know what's in there. Shea butter, beeswax, natural oils, vitamin E. It was given hairspray and it still is. I don't like it. Okay, next we have, this is a miracle that this made, made it here without exploding because it is so hot. Nourishing Energy Benny. 2% sugar or 2 gram sugar, 95 milligrams of caffeine, yerba mate, um, and aptogens. Lychee peach is the flavor. I love a good peach drink, so... Hopefully this is yummy. It is sparkling and it says it's plant-based energy. Um, a can has 20 calories. It has water, yerba mate, and then organic peach juice followed by organic cane sugar. Um, and then it's like natural flavors ashwagandha root powder so it looks pretty healthy stevia extract um so um says forget everything you know about energy drinks we've cut the nasties so you can skip the jitters and the crash um interested to try that i've never heard of this brand before i've never seen it in the store before so benny in lychee peach I'm going to come back to that. Then we have a... Y'all, that lip balm, it, it almost went real south there. I still got a little bit of it lingering, but ugh, it's not for me. Okay, so this is Native Spa Madagascar Vanilla Soothing Body Oil. 88% natural ingredients, vegan, bottled with recycled plastic, nourishing quinoa oil, and African vanilla. Um, I can't read that. I think it's the ingredients. 
So, um, now, now my skin is irritated. <laughs> this is not going as I planned. Let's just keep it going and put this oil on here. Mm, it smells good. It's a, um, I don't want to say musk, but it's not a fruity vanilla. It's not a, a cooking vanilla. It is, it is a, like a light perfume vanilla fragrance. It smells really nice. Um, so we got this. This is the last item. So I'll move that box out the way. We have twist. And there we go. Um, so this is luxury perfume without limits. Long lasting fragrance, clean ingredients. Global regulatory standards created by world class perfumes, paraben free. Phthalate 3, cruelty free, vegan friendly. So, twist. Here is what it has um, notes wise. It's inspired by amber, ombre, vanilla. Van okay, so we didn't took ombre or amber and vanilla and we made it ambre vanilla. Laura Mercier. Um, top notes are orchid. Heliotrope and tangerine. Middle is almond and coconut. Base is sandalwood. A blast of sweet citrus that first blends nicely with strong orchid, creamy coconut, and powdery almond. The heliotrope is also present, adding a soft floral touch. The dry down is dominant by, dominated by sandalwood. A very nice gourmand fragrance. So there is a only two ounce it says to help you explore your next favorite scent huh I don't know I don't know how that works exactly but anyways um so here this is um so it looks like Twist is the company name. Antique number 89 is the actual perfume. Um, and I can smell it without picking anything. It, it was a fragrance that was coming through. It smells amazing. Um, it's given grown up. Grown up things. And I'm not a perfume wearer. I might put this on and go somewhere. Okay, we know I'm not leaving the house, so that's probably not true. But I love the packaging. This is like really cute packaging. So I, uh, what is the two ounces of? Oh, wood number 28. This is a different fragrance. have to check them out. It's very interesting. It's I wonder if you can make your own fragrances. Twistperfumes.com if you're interested. Okay, so then we have I believe this is a might be a necklace. I saw something on Instagram where she was talking about the necklace she wears, but without the gold mine and Choco logo charm. Um, this is really nice. I wish there was a menu card included. So, uh, a really nice chain. I have not had... Um... Oh, this may be an anklet. It's a little too short for a for a necklace. I think this is an anklet. I have not had a really nice 
chain or any jewelry since y'all remember Mervyn's, the Mervyn's days. But yeah, this is probably anklet or, or there's no reason for this long dangle if it's uh, for your wrist. Um, but y'all remember, remember, I had like lots of nice jewelry. I'm not even sure what happened to all of it. Um, I, for a time I worked at Mervyn's in uh, high school, college, um, and, uh, I worked in jewelry and so I was always buying jewelry and my grandmother loved jewelry so we had all the jewelry but I just have stopped wearing jewelry over the years okay so we also have a so this is a, a definitely a um, bracelet I like that it's sort of flush um, I love the big chunky jewelry wristlets but I am at a computer all day and that is just really annoying real quick so um I don't generally wear anything but this is cute I like this and it opens and closes real easy I don't need any help to get it on or off so that is cute it's a little cute aesthetic style so we've got an anklet and a um really nice anklet like this is nice I don't know if this is real gold let me let me see if my eyes can see it does say something on here but I cannot read it um, if it's not it's a really good Plated, but I think it may be the. I'm gonna go do some research and I'll put it in the description box what I can find. Um, super cute though. So we've got the anklet and the bracelet, and then we've got the Madagascar vanilla body oil. We've got our twist antique number 89 perfume. We have our lethal kissy face. <laughs> Um, tinted lip balms. It has to be whatever they're putting in there to, for the tint because mm -mm -mm. I'm, I'm scared to even try the other ones. That went so badly. And you just never know. Um, we've got our Moira blush, our Benny drink, and our Busy Co deodorant wipes, which save the day for my lips and this is I mean juicy it is um very well saturated and it actually opens up to be a pretty good size so I think these would be great there's no scent at all um after the gym workout it's really hot here come from outside they're very cooling and refreshing as well. Um, not sure how it works though for like cypress and pine. Uh, how, so you can de-stress. I'm, I'm curious like how that works. Um, but that is the glow up box. Let me know what your thoughts are. Let me know you have a favorite thing and let me know if you know about any of these products um, please share down below I think my favorite things are um, I really like the anklet I really like this body oil I want to get a little bit more into it and see if I really enjoy the scent um, outside of just like the little bit I tried on my arm it says it has quinoa oil and African vanilla um, and I really like the scent of the perfume. I'm not a big perfume wearer, but I can see, you know, having that for occasions, special occasions. So let me think, let me know what you think of the glow up box. Let me know if you've ever grabbed one of these glow up boxes before. Um, and um, if you grabbed this one, let me know that as well. And I'll see you back here next time. Be sure to hit that like button. Bye.